Ten years ago today, Sisters of Providence Church of the Immaculate Conception heard the news of the 9-11 attacks and scheduled a service last minute. Over 600 people attended. That day I just said, we have to go to church. That's, that was just my immediate response. And we're grateful that so many other people joined us. Now, 10 years later, the community remembers, and many gather here to find comfort once again. Priscilla Hutton's son lives in New York City. God was was with my family, which was my immediate comfort. She'll always remember what the church did for her and her family then. The first thing we did was stand and sing uh, America the Beautiful in uh, a cappella, and it was extremely profound. It was one of those once in a lifetime things. Although it was a decade ago, many still turn to faith to answer questions. Whatever faith uh, that they belong to, that that can really give meaning to their lives and to what happens to us as a nation. That tragic day meant so many different things to people. For Hutton and O'Hara, they found strength. I just look at it and say, thank you, God, that uh, we are what we are today and, and uh, that hopefully we've learned and healed. When we go to church, we, our expectation is that we will find a sense of peace regardless of what tragedy we have to face and that with God we really can get through those things. As we continue to move forward, but never forget, in Terre Haute, Gina Galeros, News 10.